A deadly crash in far northeast El Paso is raising questions about how the intersection can be made safer. Mm -hmm. As KTSM reported over the weekend, a van and military bus crashed into each other, killing two people and injuring several others. That's right. El Paso police say this isn't the first time a deadly crash has happened in that intersection. In fact, a police report in the last two years says there have been three deadly crashes, killing four people on that stretch of road, the intersection of Gateway North Boulevard and State Line Road. Now, one woman who asked not to be on camera because of ongoing legal proceedings regarding her crash says speeding along the highway is an ongoing issue. Even before my accident, it was always something to be kind of more cautious about because like I said, in the years I've been here, I saw those fatalities happen. So I've always been cautious. I was always scared, but now more so because of what happened. Even if you have the right of way, you just never know. KTSM also spoke with TxDOT who agrees the intersection is a problem and they also say a project is already designed for an extended roundabout in that area.